All right, so for this next component, what we're gonna talk about is an application where we can break the threshold or enter into a room in a, um, a close quarters combat interior fighting environment. So CQB or CQ, CQC as it's sometimes referred to is what happens on the inside of a room when you're manipulating, um, uh, negotiating corners or m moving through the thresholds. There is a, a way to do it efficiently. There's a way to do it so you're in balance so you can be as effective as possible. So hopefully this component will help you out when it comes to how to enter the threshold in balance, but in a, in a combat ready position, right? So we know that the power of having your head up and your gun up is gonna enable your data collectors to capture as much of that room as possible. So that all happens before we break the threshold. So as an individual was to square off to a threshold, the both eyes are open, but we're not staring down the sights of the firearm. Right? The gun is in a high ready or threat ready position, which means the firearm is on repetition, ready to fire, and the trigger finger is running on the outside of the trigger guard. What this enables us to do is look over the firearm and collect as much information of that room as we possibly can. Once the decision is made for us to enter, there is a systematic way that will help us do this efficiently. And what it's referred to as a penetration step and a power step. The penetration step is the step that we use to set up before we make entry. So the penetration step essentially is with our peripheral vision, we get our feet as close to that threshold as we possibly can. So then when we do break the threshold, we are in a position to compress the springs and then drive that corner that is our responsibility. For this, for this first illustration, for myself, the responsibility will be the corner to the left, my right as you look at it. So we square off to the, the threshold, looking just over top of the sights for anything that needs our attention. If there's nothing that needs our attention in this perspective, before our muzzle breaks the threshold, we allow our periphery to see the distance to which we have to cover, and we take a little penetration step. So the penetration step is gonna load that leg. So when we step through, we break the threshold, we're in a position where this foot in the spring is compressed and we're ready to drive into that corner that is our responsibility. What you'll notice being a right-handed shooter is the majority of my body is actually still on the inside of that threshold, so it's not over ex overly exposed. The benefit to that is the head and the gun is already driving into that corner and then we can deal with whatever might be there. Right, so it's referred to as a power step in some cases and the penetration step is that small stutter step that allows our periphery to see where our foot needs to be so we can be in balance. So all together without any talking, we make entry, the assessment is made, periphery sees where we need to go, we start cheating that corner. We're in balance, the head is up, the gun is up and we have the ability to cut that corner. Being a right-handed dominant shooter, in the event that we need to go to the right, everything up to the threshold stays the same. We come into the position to be effective, making the assessment, both eyes are open, looking over top of the firearm. If nothing needs our attention at this position, take a little penetration step, we're gonna to start to load and cheat that corner. As we start to cut the corner, what we're essentially trying to do is have the muzzle as close to that threshold as we possibly can. So the moment that the threshold is broken with the muzzle, we're in a position to drive that gun into that potential danger area. So all together, we step, nothing's here, cheat the corner, little penetration step, being right hand dominant, left foot is gonna be the power step. We enter, now we're in a position that we can drive that corner effectively, head up, gun up, with the anticipation to take a shot if required.